गांव में लड़कियों को नहीं पढ़ा जाता था मैंने काफी प्रयास किया है लड़कियों को पढ़ाने के लिए आई विड ड्रू मेनी चिल्ड्रन फ्रॉम वर्क एंड एनरोल स्कूल I refuse to get married at 12 and save myself from getting ruined. I saved many of my childhood friends from getting married as well. Hame bahut dikkat hoti thi school jane mein. There weren't any separate toilets for girls at our school. As a result, most of the girls were dropping out from school after 5th standard because our parents did not allow continuing education. Together we raised our concern and got separate toilets made. Now all of us are at school. They all belong to a nation where 72% population is rural. They are the future torch bearers of a nation that is growing at 9%. These children are the seeds of transformation. They are the catalysts of change that would usher the nation on the trajectory of growth. On their tender shoulder lies the responsibility of transforming the nation. The society has not been able to uphold the rights of millions of children. The scenario certainly is not promising at the moment. and uplifting the children in rural india is a daunting task that confronts the nation it leaves a lot of ground to cover and improve the condition of children of rural india who behold the potential to transform the nation it was indeed the most critical need of the hour for the rescue of the children the future of our nation In 1980 a ray of hope emerged as bachpan bachao andolan or save the childhood movement This began in India as the first civil society initiative against child slavery and education for all children led by Kailash Satyarthi The root cause of child labor is poverty and illiteracy Inadequate facilities of education at villages coupled up with lack of government welfare schemes and gender biases set in grave hopelessness and social insecurity in children and rural adults. Bachpan Bachao Andolan diagnosed the major problem and decided to address it aggressively. We realized that we have to solve this problem right at the source. and the villages are the source of the problem of child labor unfortunately 70% of child labor workforce come from villages they live in the villages and work in the agriculture setup so we decided to create an environment where all children are withdrawn from child labor all children are attending schools the children have their own voices and finally their voices are heard by the authorities bal mitra gram or child friendly village provides to the children a platform for a new world of limitless opportunities with increased awareness bharat padega aage badhega participation for collective growth by getting access to compulsory education and associated infrastructure but it is not so easy a task due to age old customs barriers and rigidity this step involves initiating a dialogue with the parents who are completely averse to sending their already employed children to school main aaj rat nagar se aaya hu bachpan bachao andal bal ashram se is gaon mein hum bal mitra gram yojana shuru karna chahte hain to uske liye hum survey kar rahe hain is gaon ka to main aapse kuch baatein puchunga wo batana theek hai dada ji ha puchho Bringing the child to school is the primitive step. The second step of this mission is the constitution of a bal panchayat, which is children's parliament at a village level. It is the child's first step towards child rights. At bal panchayat, that is the children's parliament, children democratically elect their representatives 
to raise their voice, their concerns, in front of the Gram Panchayat, which is the village's own parliament, headed by veteran adults of the village. <laughs> Bal Panchayat also gets due recognition from Village Panchayat. Members of Gram Panchayat regularly participate in the meetings convened by Bal Panchayat and address the concerns of children. In our village, there is no pump in our village. So, the people of our village are very far away from the water. So, we have to take water on our head. So, we have to take water on our head. So, we have to take water on our head. So, we have to take water on our head. So, we have to take water on our head so that all of us इसका प्रस्ताव देंगे सर पंचायत से इस बात की दरकार देंगे सर जो भी बच्चों की जो पंचायत होती है बाल आश्रम में वो हमारी ग्राम पंचायत में जाके हमारे को बताते हैं उसका काम पूर्ण करते हैं हेड पंप की जरूरत होती है हेड पंप लगवाते हैं बिजली की जरूरत होती है तो हम बिजली लगवाते हैं उनकी जो भी अच्छा अनुसार काम मांगते हैं वो उनको उपलब्ध करवा देते हैं बाल पंचायत नॉट ओनली स्प्रेड्स अवेयरनेस अबाउट चाइल्ड राइट बट ऑल्सो गेट्स ड्यू हेल्प and assistance from respective authorities. They discussed like school building, facilities of portable water, school teachers, playgrounds and many more. Members of Children's Parliament also survey the houses to ensure that there is no one else bereft of education. They help to rescue children trapped in child labor and also help in stopping child marriages. Members of Children's Parliament also ensure that once children are enrolled in schools, they are retained throughout for completing their education. At Bal Mitra Gram, a child-friendly village, the children contribute in the holistic progress of the village by becoming developmental stakeholders of children's parliament. Members of Bal Panchayats in various villages then congregate and constitute the apex body called Maha Panchayat at national level. I am a national leader and I am a national leader. In my village, when I was not in my village, we thought about what to do with all the kids. और बीएमजी जो है एक सहारा देने के समान हमारे काम आया। बाल मित्र ग्राम्स मेजर कंपोनेंट्स आर द डेमोक्रेटाइजेशन ऑफ पंचायत, चाइल्ड पार्टिसिपेशन। इट आल्सो गिव्स द लीगल अवेयरनेस अबाउट चाइल्ड राइट्स। बाल मित्र ग्राम वर्क्स रिलेंटलेसली अगेंस्ट जेंडर इनिक्वालिटीज। it also inculcates the most important and valuable qualities of leadership. Today in India, there exist more than 275 child-friendly villages. More than a hundred are on the path to becoming child-friendly. The BBA or Bachpan Bachao Andolan is working across India to save children from the clutches of child labor by bringing them under the ambit of self-governance and contributing to the overall development of the nation. There is very least consciousness towards child rights in our society and particularly in villages. So the child-friendly village program is to create that consciousness of child participation, child leadership and child rights. Bal Mitra Gram is an initiative that confers calculated responsibility and child rights at the grassroot level at the villages, instilling impeccable governance for the children, by the children. Abigail Van Buren had once said that if you want children to keep their feet on the ground, put some responsibility on their shoulders. <laughs>